I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Earlier, I uh, mentioned you gotta ask yourself what you're gonna do if Clementine's parents don't show. Yeah, you did. You think that's gonna happen? Her parents showing up? No, I don't. Well, I want you to know that I think you've got it in you. I think you can take care of that little girl just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know, it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait. Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. dinosaur was toast but you know what he wasn't oh and then hey duck uh you want to cool it for a minute okay sorry i'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here no it's not that it's i got grabbed again i was there though i fell and my walkie-talkie broke glenn had the other one oh i'm sorry thanks I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. <sighs> Let me go deal with this. Oh, man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? 
Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor ain't pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. <laughs>